Greetings. LQZ, the Lord is good to me. XQS, Mo's religion is a mess. GJH, our God is truly great. XQS, what does it mean? This is a sign from God. LQZ, what does it mean? This is a sign from God. It is a miracle that only God knows. Really? Seriously? Well, yes, according to Islam, many surah begin with just such gibberish. Just look up Alif Lam Mim. Let's take a look at a few. Surah 2-1 begins Alif Lam Mim. Surah 3-1 begins Alif Lam Mim. Surah 7-1 begins Alif Lam Mim Sad. Surah 10-1 begins Alif Lam Ra. Surah 11-1 begins Alif Lam Ra. Surah 12-1 begins Alif Lam Ra. Surah 13 begins Alif Lam Mim Ra. X, Y, Z, gibberish to me. Alif Lam Ra, a mocking guffaw. Surah 14-1 begins Alif Lam Ra. Surah 15-1 begins Alif Lam Ra. Surah 19-1 begins Kaf Ha Ya Ain Sad. Kaf Ha Ya Ain Sad. Now this does make sense if you realize it is Texan and not Arabic. Kaf Ha Y'all ain't sad. Yet. Surah 21 begins Taha. 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 Tihi. It's gibberish to me. Taha. Tihi. He's laughing at thee. Surah 26 1 begins Ta Sin Mim. I hope you begin to see the point. Gibberish makes sense when you're toking a joint. But in a message from the God of Ages, he wouldn't waste time or rhyme or pages with random letters that only fetters the message he's trying to teach. So the Quran has all this random gibberish starting many surahs. Yet the Quran attempts to say it is clear. Really? Seriously? Letters that mean nothing, like XYZ, or Alif Lam Mim Sad, or Taha, are not clear. And to twist and literally invert the gibberish and call it a sign from some deity is willful self-deception. I think you need to really consider the possibility that Muhammad was mocking the gullibility of those who followed him. O oh, Prophet, what is this sign from Allah? How do we know your words are true? Say, O oh Muslim, excuses. This is the sign from Allah. Only Allah knows what it means. Could a man make up such a wise and true saying? Excuses is the true saying. Of that is no doubt. If you call yourself Muslim, Please use the brain that Almighty God gave you. God would not send incomprehensible gibberish as a message, as a sign, and then dare to call it clear. Alif Lam Mim is the same as excuses. Do not fall for Muhammad's excuses. May the Spirit of God open your eyes to the light, your ears to the truth, and your heart to His Son, the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.